Hi guys, and welcome to this week's video on what did I buy this week. As you can tell, this week has been kind of a busy week, and so I, um, I have lots of deals to share with you, and I'm going to try to make it go as fast as possible, um, but we do have a lot of things to get through. Um, this week was amazing, and switching here to my totals, and so basically the totals for everything is over $200 this week, $200, $220.50, and my out-of-pocket expense was just $39, so, um, so yeah, so a lot of really good deals, um, we're going to take you store by store, and basically show you how I did it, changed it up a little bit this, this time, and so I've got all the products behind me, so we'll be going over them one by one. Also, I did think I would explain something um, about my videos. Sometimes in my videos you can see that strange little cabinet over there, and I don't know, maybe it's just me, but I think it's kind of weird. So, um, if you don't know what it is, so I thought I would kind of explain that real quick. Um, we are very blessed to live in a large house, a large home. We have a beautiful home, and it is three stories, and so counting the basement. So that is a laundry chute. So um, I film in our guest room, and that is the guest room laundry chute. So if any of you that don't know me are watching and like, why do they have a random cabinet in their wall? That's why. So okay, let's get to it. Okay, the first store. This is by far the largest. Um, amount of products I bought this week came from this store. It was Walgreens. I actually did, um, I went a couple times because I saw some things that were on sale and I knew that there were some coupons available so um, today while I was off work I went back and got them. And so anyway, so we're going to go over everything we got there. I usually don't buy a lot of things at, at Walgreens, usually just their free stuff, but today there was just like all of these super great deals. Okay, so I bought a lot of cereal this week. Um, it's not actually like too much cereal. The thing is, is that um, how much you stock up on really depends on your family. And now my boys, I have two growing boys, and they love cereal. And in fact, if they had to pick their favorite kinds, these are them. So I'll give a little bit more for something that I know is like something that my family is going to use. And this is something that my family uses. And so I'm going to go over go over the totals with this. So Walgreens had this great sale this week. And I know that some people stock up on sale when it's just this price. Um, so all of their uh, General Mills cereals were $1.99. And that's a, that's a super good deal on its own. But I've got coupons to make it better. Um, so anyway, so the Cookie Crisp and the Reese's were $4.49 on sale for $1.99. We used a dollar off two General Mills cereal coupon, making it $1.49, guys. That's a super great deal. Now, I know a lot of people don't stock up on cereal unless it's a dollar or less. But, and that's fine, like, that's kind of my rule of thumb if it's not a cereal that we eat often. But, like I said, this is my, like, family's favorite. So, it's a great time to go ahead and stock up on it because $1.49 is cheaper than the off-brand. So, that was a, a, a biggest, uh, my biggest thing. The Cocoa Puffs were $3.99, again on sale for $1.99, and the dollar off too, so make them $1.49, and the Tricks was a $3.99 and on sale for $1.99. So what it totaled up to was $29.93, say $29.93 worth of cereal and the sale price on that was $13.93, so it brought it down to $13.93. Then we had $3.50 off in coupons making our total $10.43 for the seven boxes of, of cereal, or like I said before, $1.49 each. Great deal. So that's a super great deal. Okay, so that's the cereal. The next thing that I bought was the Morton Epsom salt. Oh, these are heavy. Okay. The Morton Epsom salt was the four pound bag, and it was originally 4 dollars 
and it is on sale for four dollars and then there is a register reward for four dollars making it absolutely free the next thing at Walgreens was the scope and it was um, this I used register reward point, um, system and I used a coupon so it was originally three ninety nine it was on sale for two ninety nine and then I had a seventy five cent off coupon making it two dollars and twenty four cents in which we got a two dollars and fifty cent registry reward back so this was an overage a money maker of twenty six cents a bottle so they paid me twenty six cents a bottle to take them out of the store I'll take that okay the last deal in Walgreens was one of my favorites of the week now the off clip on mosquito repellent um these you clip on your clothes and you clip on your side or somewhere and um, it repels mosquitoes. Now these, I've been looking at these all summer. My youngest son is very allergic to mosquitoes and so I'm always having a spray when he goes out. So I've really been looking at these but they're, they're kind of expensive. They are $9.99 and they're, they're a little bit cheaper at Walmart but at Walgreens they were $9.99 and they had them on sale this week on clearance for $4.99 and there was a coupons.com printable coupon for $4 off making this 99 cents what a what a great deal so 99 cents for a 9.99 product that's a great deal and it's something we're going to use and so um i would i bought four of them i have four of them and then um it was the same kind of deal on the off clip on uh, refills. That's what it is, refills. And so they were originally six ninety nine, and they were on sale for two ninety nine. And the um, the coupon was a two dollar off any off refills. Off off yeah off off <laughs> refills. So making them ninety nine cents. So again great deal so I got so I got um they only had one so um I still got a couple more coupons so if I find them next week or whenever we'll be we'll be getting them. I did a Walgreens video this week and I don't know if I'll upload this video first or if I'll upload the other video first but if not you'll see kind of what I did with these and so I made some I had some overages that I wanted to use from previous register rewards so I needed to kind of balance that out. You'll see in my video. But anyway, these were on sale. They're originally a dollar, and they um, they um, were on sale for forty nine cents. And so, great deal. So anyway, I picked up three of those, and my boys don't know. So um, after the video, I'll take them to my to my three men, so they can actually have them. So, but. We got them in the video this week. The total was like, it was $94.84 for just the Walgreens stuff. So that includes the cereal, the two bags of the four pound Epsom salt, the two bottles of Scope mouthwash, the four off clip on mosquito repellents, the one off clip on refill, and three Baby Ruth candy bars. So, a grand total for all of that at Walgreens at regular price would have cost me $94.84. And my price out of pocket was $17.37. Again, most of that being the cereal because that's something our, our family's going to use a lot of. So, that's Walgreens. So the next store I'm going to talk about is Harbor Freight. If you watched my video last week on how to get free tools, you'll see some of these kind of great deals that I've been using over the last couple couple weeks. I've had extra coupons and so I'm really excited about continuing to get them. And so anyway, yes, yeah, so we got a lot of great deals. Um, 
I actually did kind of a vlog style um, video shopping at Harbor Freight tonight while um, my husband and my kids were with me. So um, I hope to get that um, kind of edited and put up and so that will be a fun little video for you guys to see. See how we shop and how you can get the whole family involved. So let's go over what we got. So um, I always go through my coupons and ask my husband, hey, um, is there anything specific that you would like out of the free things? Sometimes there isn't, sometimes there is, sometimes I've gotten more than one of them, so it doesn't really matter. But, um, so this was kind of something that he kind of asked for. He's like, I don't know where mine went, um, in the process of moving and everything. So, um, so it's kind of a neat little thing. It is a swivel lens head lamp for camping, emergency, and sports. He actually uses this a lot like when he's working on cars and you know or something one of the vehicles and he has to like see you know we have um, two garages but uh, it still can get dark in there so um, so this is kind of great and it was um, $9.99 and I had a free yeah this was free with any purchase so what I bought were these and these are um, box cutters. They're like or box openers, or I don't really know if they have a specific name. Anyway, they're just um, yeah, they're just they're just a box opener. So um, anyway, they are forty nine cents normally, but they were on sale for twenty nine cents. So um, so bought with this was free with any purchase. I just picked up one of these little bad boys. So it was 29 cents, I think after tax it was like 31 cents, you know, so great deal. The second item is this 6 inch magnetic parts holder. And so this is to put like your nuts and bolts and things in it and it says automotive. I don't, I'm not sure why it said automotive. Um, there was another one that's, that wasn't automotive but the, the coupon was for the automotive one. Um, but it was only four inches, so it was a little bit smaller. So this was actually the larger one. So anyway, um, it's the six-inch Pittsburgh autom automotive magnetic parts holder, and it was originally six ninety-nine. It was free with any purchase. Again, we did the the box cutter. Actually, did three of these, so we'll get all of them out. So we did the box cutter. 49 cents on sale again, 29 cents. So for 29 cents, got both of them. Okay, the next item that was the last item, free with any purchase, which we again got the box, box cutter. And these would be great for like, just stick them in the stocking or, you know, I don't know, it, it doesn't matter. They're 29 cents. So um, we got another one of these six piece. Um, screwdriver set. You saw me get this last week, so we've got we've got another one. So again, these are great for Christmas or gifts, birthdays, anything. They're just great to have, and they're free. So with a you know twenty nine cent box, you know opener. So that's great. So that's another that's another really good thing. This is originally four ninety nine. Again, twenty nine cents. Buy free with any purchase. We got that. The next two products were absolutely free, no purchase required. Um, the, the first one is the three and a half inch mini flashlight and um, I started couponing years ago. I did it a lot with my mom and um, this was her favorite thing to get. Um, if she had a Harbor Freight coupon, she got the flashlight. We had so many little, these, these little LED flashlights. Um, and so I always think of my mom when I buy LED flashlights and so it's just, you know, one of those things. She's been gone for a few years now and um, so anyway, this was my mom, so this is for you mom. Um, but um, mini flashlights, she loved these things. So this was $4.99 and it was free, no purchase required. and. Um, this is actually in my vlog that I filmed tonight where I actually made my husband and son pick these up. So it's great. So $4.99 after coupon absolutely free. And the multi-purpose scissors were also $4.99. Again, after super coupon that was free, no purchase required. Absolutely free. So this is my Harbor Freight kind of deals. And the three um, box openers, one of them's over there. So all this stuff totaled together 
and the screwdrivers were $33.42 and my out of pocket expense was a total of 87 cents. So all this stuff for, you know, and the screwdrivers and the three box cutters for less than a dollar, 87 cents. So yeah, great deal. Okay, the next place that I shopped this week was Walmart. Again, I didn't get a lot of things at Walmart this week, um, but I did get a few things. The old El Paso taco seasoning. They are on rollback right now. I think they're originally like a dollar, but they're on rollback right now for 75 cents. And then I had a dollar off of three coupon, so it made them 41 cents. These are, um, I, I sometimes make my own seasoning, but um, these are great to have if I can get them cheap. The next thing I got were these disposable razors, and um, these were a great deal. They were $2.68 each, and I had a $2 off any big disposable razor, so I got one of the guys and one of the girls. I thought the girls' packaging was kind of neat. It actually, it, it, I, I tore it apart. It was, it was like glued together up here. So basically, they come in two like equal sections, and what I love about this, it's probably a loud rattling, what I love about this is that um, I use these primarily to give away. So I'm, I'll make care packages for families and so um, because my husband and I have specific razors that we kind of like and so I get coupons for those too. So but if I can get any razor really cheap, you know, free or really cheap, then I buy them for care packages and so by being able to um, divide them in half like that means that I can bless two different families with them without giving them an open razor, which is, that, that's weird, you don't want to do that. So anyway, so these were a $2.68 and that we had a $2 off coupon, which made them $0.68 cents a piece. So that, that was a really good deal. Okay, the next item that I got was the contact cleaner. This was $5.38. I had a $3 off any OptiFree um, product. And so this made them $2.38. And this is one of those things, guys, that um, I bought this because I needed it. It wasn't free and it wasn't even like less than a dollar, like that cheap, you know, it was $2.38. But these are things that I need. And so um, as you kind of shop, as you go, as we go through these, you'll see items that were higher in price that maybe I didn't get a good percentage on. But it's something that my family needs. And so I want to include them in our video because that's what, that's how I shop. And that's what I want to show you guys is that, you know, of course we can get things free, which is always great. But you're going to notice the difference when you start saving money on everything that you're buying. And so we need a contact solution, like literally like we got like that much. In fact, my husband was like, would you do the video so we can open up the boxes? So, um, so anyway, so yeah, these are you know, this is my favorite brand, and I and so when I can get a coupon for my favorite brand, I always grab it. Again, five dollars and thirty-eight cents, three dollar off coupon, making them two dollars and thirty-eight cents. It was a good deal. The next deal that I got at Walmart was for the toothbrushes, and they are they're originally like a dollar ninety-four. Yeah, dollar ninety-four. They're on rollback for ninety-four cents, and they are a dollar fifty off of two which makes them 19 cents each. And then, um, so I had two of those, whoops. So I had two of those, and then I had a um, 50 cents off of, no sorry, 75 cents off of one coupon, and so this one was 25 cents. But again, if I can get them a quarter and under, that's my stock up price to be able to, to have them. Um, now I wanna say something about these guys. These are the cavity defense ones, and so, the coupon, I believe it will beep and they might not accept it if you get the, I think it's called clean and some, I'm not sure. It's the ones in the trial sizes. If you get the 96 cent ones or whatever in the trial section or in the travel section, um, I, don't, I don't think the coupon is good for that one. So you got to be careful with that one. But these are not. These are on rollback and these are a different toothbrush and they... They worked on these. 
So again, 19 cents y'all for toothbrushes. That's awesome. Okay, so that's my, that's all, that's everything I got at Walmart. So for the, the toothbrushes and the contact cleaner and the two packages of razors and the Old El Paso taco seasoning, that made my total $28.05 which I had to pay $8.38. So again, you know, it's not the like, oh my gosh, it was a zero balance, but it's, I saved a lot of money on the products that my family are going to use. Okay, the next store that we're gonna go over is Target, and I actually didn't plan on doing any shopping at Target this week, but tonight when um, my husband and boys went out, we, uh, we all went out, um, my husband needed to stop there for something, and they had their, like, you know, their dollar section up by the front. They had everything with the, with the black triangle on clearance for 75, or no, sorry, 70% off. Okay, yeah, 70% off. So I got, y'all, this is awesome. I got my son nine Get them all here. Nine pair of socks. And these are the cutest things. They are Ninja Turtles and Cars. And then we have the Avengers and um, Spider Man and um, what's that one? Oh, Captain America. And so, so yeah, they, they're great. So they're originally a dollar a pair. They are on clearance right now for 70% off. It makes them 30 cents a pair. These, these are super great, guys. Um, now, I, I bought them for my son, but they would be great for stocking stuffers for Christmas and, and birthdays and things, or just buy them because socks are so expensive normally. So this is this is super great deal. So my total, um, again, they were originally a dollar, so if, it would have been $9, and what I paid out of pocket was $2.70. It's less than a pa what a package would have been. Okay, guys, um, the one of the last stores I'm going to talk about is Hobby Lobby. And again, this isn't one of those things where I got something like ridiculously cheap. Although you can get things really, really cheap at Hobby Lobby like at the end of the season. So like after Halloween, all of their stuff will start going on sale, start, you know, at one price they'll get cheaper and cheaper and cheaper until it gets all the way down to like 90% off, which is super awesome. So look for those deals. Um, so anyway, um, but I wanted to again show you this is how I shop. Everything that I buy, it, <laughs> I jokingly say the F word in my house is full price. We don't say full price. <laughs> so, um, so if I'm going to buy something, I don't want to pay full price for it. I want, I want a bargain. So, um, one of the things I love to do is I always love to have a beautiful wreath on my front door. And I don't know if you've seen wreaths at Hobby Lobby and Michaels. Oh my gosh, they're so expensive. Like, if you buy one that they kind of put together, it's like $45. But if you buy one that is like their brand and shipped in, it's like $160 for a wreath, y'all. Y'all are leaving this outside your house. And I'm like, I, you wouldn't leave a $200 item just sitting out in the yard. No, why would you leave a $200 wreath on your on your door to get tore up or or blown off or something? So anyway, with all that nonsense, um, I make my own, and so I wanted to kind of show you um, what you know what kind I got. So um, I, I'm getting ready to make a fall wreath, and I may even do a tutorial on kind of. Um, my inspiration wreath and um, then the one that I made and how much the difference is. So, I may. Um, the fall burlap ribbon. Now, let me explain something, guys. The You can get burlap ribbon in, a, in several places in Hobby Lobby. But right now, the fall collection is on sale for 40% off. So, if you buy the regular burlap ribbon, which is same stuff, um, it's going to be full price, and it's going to be $5.99. Um, if you buy the full burlap ribbon, it is going to be 40% off. So, um, $5.99 originally, um, 
40% off, made it $3.59. So I didn't have to use a coupon on this. Now, these I did use coupons on, and they were $2.99, and I used a 40% off coupon on my phone, um, and I got them for $1.79. And so, um, again, guys, this is just something that I, that I like to do, and I wanted to do, and, you know, why not make sure that you can use a coupon to do it as well. Okay, guys, so the last thing I'm going to talk to you tonight about is, um, tonight my husband and my boys went out to dinner, and we went to our favorite restaurant, um, Who Hot, and I kind of want to talk to you about store reward, um, cards and how those kind of can work. And so, um, anyway, Who Hot's our favorite place to eat, and they have a loyalty card, and you, for every however many dollars you spend, you get points, and those points end up, you know, getting cash. Now, I want to talk for just a second about the difference between a loyalty card and a credit card. Okay, so there are a lot of places that have just a store loyalty card, and that is something that, it's not a credit card, it basically just tracks your purchases and gives you rewards for spending more money there. And a credit card, like, um, you know, Kohl's has a credit card, and Target has a credit card, and stuff, and, and they're, they're going to give you, like, 5% off or something or whatever to use their credit card, and I do not recommend those. Um, yes, you're going to save 5%, but you're going to be paying 30% in interest, and, you know, a lot of people say, oh, well, I paid off at the end of the month. Do you? Do you really pay it off every single month? Because I know all y'all had like great intentions of paying it off. You know, I've been there. I've been like, oh, I'll pay that off when we get paid. And then, well, I could pay this and pay, you know how it is. So, anyway, don't do it. Just, 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 just don't do it. And so, that's just going to cost you money. And we're about saving money. Don't, don't save 5% to pay 30% interest. Pay cash, people. So, anyway... A loyalty card is where you just earn points. And Who Hot is our favorite place to eat, and so we eat there often. And they've actually had a couple of promotions lately where you got like double points and things, so it's been great. So we hadn't really checked our point balance, and so um, tonight we had we had three adult dinners because my son's a teenager now, and then we had one child dinner, and then we did get the uh, Gobi Nana's dessert. By the way, y'all, it was gross. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Don't get it. Don't get it. The total was, yeah, the total here, oh, was $44.75, okay? So that's for all four of us to eat dinner. And then I use my loyalty, we use our loyalty card, and we had $40 on it. Yeah, $40. So we ate out, we ate dinner tonight, um, for four dollars and forty-five cents, y'all. I don't know if that'll focus or not. If it doesn't, I'll I'll put up a still picture. But um, yeah, of course that's not including a tip, and we do we do tend to tip fairly well. So um, but yeah, but just the cost of our meal alone was four dollars and forty-five cents, and. So I added that into my totals this week because I wanted to show you just, you know, again, it's one of those ways that I save money on just everyday things. And so just pay attention. So that, so that's it for this week, guys. Um, it's been a great week. Um, I, I, again, I, I work full time, so I don't get a lot of um, time to shop, and I'm going to do a time-saving video soon, I know I keep saying that, um, so that you can kind of see how I shop when I don't have time, um, so sometimes after work or mostly on the weekends and stuff, so I'm going to do a video on that real soon, but, um, so yeah, it's been a great, it's been a great um, week for couponing and saving money, um, so for my total for everything this week was 200 and twenty dollars and fifty cents and I paid out of pocket thirty nine dollars and seventy seven cents 
So, I mean, I think that's a great deal. Um, I'm spending money, you know, when I'm, when I'm getting things free, I'm getting things free, but the things that I actually spend money on are things I'm using. Make sure that that's, uh, if you're going to spend your money, make sure it's going to be on something you're going to use. And so, um, it's been a great week. Um, got a lot of neat stuff. I'm excited to take it and put it in my stockpile. And, and yeah, so, um, be sure to like my video, guys, and subscribe, leave me any comments in, in the comment section below if you have any questions or if you have ideas for future videos or anything like that. So until next time guys, see ya!